Hi, this is George Fear, and thanks for following the Fish Guys. To see our latest adventures, make sure you subscribe to our YouTube channel. You know, and you're swimming yeah, at right. 30, 32 degrees Celsius water. Well, you, you know, if your body temperature, if we're talking Fahrenheit, your body temperature is 98, let's assume that water is 75. After a while, you're going to cool off. 75 might be warm. You hear that noise? Yes, I did. So, let me get out the door. Oh, yeah. This is my wetsuit. Oh, it's your wetsuit. <laughs> That's the arm of my suit. I thought the tire was like yeah, right. banded off. 
Okay, uh, transition to the next place. We're headed to Chavi Ripa. Yeah. The falls. We're heading to the Chavi Ripa River, next yeah. to the Chavi Ripa Falls. And you have to please remind me to take pictures of the Podostemasia aquatic plants. The ones that grow on, on the rapids. Yep. And they have that big purple flower. And the snails. Oh, the snails! My God! If we forget the snails, okay, okay then we, we have to retire from this business. Okay. Snails, we got to get that story of the snails right. ready. Yeah, yeah. Which we can talk about later. It's a long subject with those snails. Alright, now we're we're on we're going there one with one goal in mind and that's to get this this juvenile black piranhas in the river stream. It's a very small river at that point. And uh, we're hoping to find their mommy and daddy. So that we can get black runners in clear water. That would be a first. Not, no. a, not, a, not a first, because I saw an old some footage on television years, years, years ago where they got some blacks. Supposed to be uh, Venezuelan black. They were Ben blacks. In a black big piranha. aquarium. I, that's what I said. It was an aquarium too, an because aquarium. because of the you can see the light on the top, and you see the plants that are not from even there. Uh, yeah. You got Microsoft from Asia or something. Yeah, like right. And I also thought I saw a. Uh, a uh, I remember talking about this guy ten years ago. I thought I saw a uh, Lamprolocus crochardi swimming in the rocks. So that fish is from Africa. <laughs> so you know, it's probably not. Uh, this is the real McCall. Yes. Yeah, this, this, we have to try out our pumping gadget so we can get good footage of the water. Get yes, those yes. deep, but deep in thought, just in case. Just in case National Geographic in the, in the making of this thing that they're making now, they might be tempted to use that footage again. Oh, we yeah. Point out to them that that's not an aquarium footage, but that's, that's not yeah. in situ footage. Yeah, if they use this for the. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We, should, we should just make that point. Oh, by the way, you know, there is. Yeah, you might have access to that. You might think it's real, but it's, we should just make the point. But they, they still may want to use it. Maybe they don't give. A yeah. But anyways, we're hoping to get very good footage of that. And right. if mommy way, and daddy get in there, they they could get a good chunk out of you. Yeah, sure. The only way we're going to get them is they're going to be sitting in the holes down below the falls. And so we're going to rig up a breathing apparatus. To it's drop into one of those holes. It's going to be a new experience to swim with that species. Big, big, yeah. big yeah. black bronze. Yeah. Big black bronze. That's going to be a new, speed, a new experience. Yeah. Because we have done it before at Rose, but you know, not not a large amount or in that confined area. Well, I think the Caribe are more dangerous than the Browns are. Dehydrated, so we just you know kneeled like like a horse, right, you know, okay. Oh, okay, got okay, it, okay. you know, and yeah. put our faces in the water, started drinking like a camel. We're on top of the Chiviripa Mountain. We made it up the falls. It took us around three hours, but we made it up here. Up here, you have an oasis um, with a lot of moriche palms. You got George Fear filming in the back, and. You know, we're drinking there like camels, like dogs, and 
I'm like, okay, where's George? What happened to George? You know? So Mark was like, George starts, you know, crying for you. And you come out of the bush, like from one side of the tall grass. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You just come out and you look like you didn't know where you were. Yeah. You looked like you were so confused, red, hot, you know? Yeah. You look like a crazy person coming well, out of that really, Well, that's maybe what it looked like. But I knew where I was because I found you. <laughs> I went up the whole other side of the mountain and went right in, and went right to you, and you went straight up the front. Yeah. So yeah, yeah, did I not know where I was? No, you were. No, you knew where you were. But when you when you came out, you looked, you know, like. Well, it was 120 goddamn degrees. I climbed up the freaking side of the mountain all by myself. I had no water. The freaking buzzards were buzzing over my head. Yeah, yeah. It was hot, man. When Richard broke out of that brush. Oh. I had calluses for the longest time. The, the, the rocks would burn, you wouldn't yeah, even touch yeah, it. Yeah, yeah. And uh, more with that desert uh, varnish or whatever it has, you know, yeah. those waterfalls. Yeah. And uh, it was just so funny to see you coming out of that bush. It looked like if you had gone nuts. I've lived there for 20 years. Like a madman, right? yes. Yeah. You, look, you look like a hermit that, you know, saw a ghost or something, you know. You were... uh, I remember walking across, I got up to the top, and at the, the top, you know, no stream inside, no river, no nothing, except it's, it was jet black from having been burned off and baked. And just hot, hot, hot. And just hopping these big boulders crossing the top of the mountain. I drank like a gallon of water kneeling in that river. I didn't I don't think I drank. You drink you didn't drink any water at all. I didn't drink anything at all except that which you know yeah. the snorkel did. You know, paid for it going down. Yeah. So climbing that waterfall, that mountain was You sure we haven't passed? I'm sure we have not passed. Remember this river is full of rays, so don't lift your feet up much, you know, just kind of drag them on the floor. Is it better here? You see my feet? Do you see my feet? No. No? Oh, that's bad. <laughs> 